Hey everyone, so today we are doing the letter D, which stands for... Dinosaur! Okay, dinosaur does start with a D, but that's not what we're talking about today. No? Well, what else starts with the letter D? Duh. Not that either. We're doing D is for... Dog! D is for dog! Where'd you come from? Well, I'm gonna talk about dog later. Are we seriously doing this? Yes, we did the letter A on you, so we're doing D is for dogs. Haha, <laughs> in your face. Hey! Did you just see what he said to me? It's fine. Schuster, can you wait here while we go over what the letter D looks like? Yeah, sounds good. I'll be back to get you in a second. Man, where did he come from? That's Schuster, right? Let's go over the letter D with everyone, just to show them what it looks like. Ooh, there's like a hole in the, in the middle of it. Yeah, a good way to remember D, the letter D is like D is for donut. Donuts? I want a donut. I want a donut too. Oh, be quiet. You can maybe get one later. Yeah, this is what the letter D looks like. And what sound does it make? Duh, duh, duh. What else starts with the, what else starts with the letter D? Dad. Yes, dad starts with the letter D. What else? Diamond. Yes, diamond. Anything else? Uh, dada? <laughs> Same thing as dad. And do you, can you think of anything else? Um, 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 dun, dun, dun! Okay. Well, that is what the letter D looks like. I will put some worksheets down below so you can practice writing it. I need to work on that. Yeah, you do need to work on that. Aiden has a tendency to write the letter D, the capital D, backwards in his name. He doesn't like writing his name in lowercase letters. Uh-uh. I like to put it all big catch so it goes like Aiden! Okay, shh, shh. Not Aiden. <laughs> but that is what the letter D looks like. So you have a big D and a lowercase D. You don't want to mix it up with the letter B. Yes, the letter B. Uh... In my B video, I mentioned that when I was little, I used to mix up the letter B and D when I was writing it out. So make sure you do practice that lowercase letter quite a bit when you are learning how to write it. Well, now what? Now I'm going to interview Schuster about dogs. What the, 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 the? You're fine. We'll see you a little bit later, okay, Aiden? Can I go to get a donut? Okay, fine. Go get a donut. Give me my sunglasses. Why? I gotta go get the donut! There. See you later, dudes and dudettes. Okay. <laughs> now I will get Schuster. He is a pet dog. Hey, watch up! So Schuster is a beagle. Uh-huh. I named him Schuster because uh, my parents had a dog named Simon. And Simon and Schuster. That's what he kind of looks like. Uh-huh. That's why you got the name. Well, let's go over some dog facts that we found. Okay. So let's go ahead and open this up. So I can ask you a few, few questions, okay? Oh. What's your favorite scent to pick up when you do smell anything? Food. I love food. What? Actually, I think I smell a donut. You don't smell a donut. I don't have donuts here. Want a bat? I don't have a donut. I smell one. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Huh. Well, I don't know. Here, here. Oh, you think it's down there? Down where? Down here. There's nothing in the bag. Yes, I see it. I see a donut. No, no, no. Okay, shoot, shoot, shoot. Say excuse me. Excuse me. Okay, anyways, let's get back to our facts. So, you like to pick up scents. Did you know that your scent, your nose, can pick up a smell a hundred thousand times better than a human can? No way, is that why we're such good trackers? Yes, that is why you guys are such good hunting dogs, especially beagles. Uh, and I learned that dogs with bigger ears also have a better sense of smell because their bigger ears, it helps scent go up their nose. Oh, so I'm meant to be a hunting dog? Yeah, what do you like to hunt for? Donuts. Okay. And did you know that you can also hear 10 times better than a human? Really? Yes. So have you ever heard a dog whistle? Yeah. And I, so I'm sure you might have seen a dog whistle, but humans can't really register a dog whistle. Sometimes you might be able to, but not a lot of the time. So my hearing is better than yours? Yeah. Oh, man, that's kind of cool. It is pretty cool. And there are also 400 t different types of dog breeds. That's a lot of dog breeds. Yes, you're one of them. You're a beagle. There's also a Labrador, Labradoodle, um, Pitbull. Uh, Great Dane. Yes, Great Dane's another one. And there's, oh, that's another thing we can talk about, is that about small dogs and big dogs. Oh, yeah. A small dog is like a chihuahua. Yes, a small dog is considered to be six to nine inches tall. That's about, how old your nose? That's about this tall is how big a chihuahua is. That's tiny. Well, that's about how tall, you stand a little bit taller than 11 inches. I mean, taller than nine inches. And then a uh, bigger dog will, can be uh, 40 inches tall. 
40 inches. Yeah, for example, a Great Dane, when they're standing on their hind legs, these are the hind legs that went on a dog. Yeah, so you don't touch my feet. Okay, sorry. <laughs> when you stand on your hind legs, when a Great Dane stands on their hind, hind legs, they can stand up to seven feet tall. That's bigger than you. I'm five foot seven, so yes, that is bigger than me. And it's bigger than most humans. And what else do you like to eat besides donuts? Dog food. <laughs> Anything else? I know lots of stuff. I'm an omnivore. Yes. Uh, Schuster is an omnivore. And also one more thing. What colors do you see right now? I see all the colors, but they're, they're not as bright as how you would see them. That is right. So dog sees a little bit differently than a human does. The picture here. What's that? That is actually a, I think it's a golden retriever. You better be right. You're going to get hate comments. Hopefully I am. I'm more, I have cats. My parents have dogs, so I don't know breeds all that well, but... There's different colors that a dog sees. Oh, so I see uh, the bottom one is a little bit brighter than the blue, green, and yellow on the top. Exactly. Dogs can see colors. Um, they can see all the colors that we do, but the greens, yellow, and blue colors tend to stand out a little bit more. Uh-huh. So I see the sky. I can see trees and stuff, especially in the fall. Uh, and grass. Grass. I like grass. You like grass? Uh huh. I go potty in the grass. <laughs> As you should. Uh, anything else you'd like to share? Uh, can you go for a walk? Yes, we can go for a walk. I hope you guys learned a little bit of facts about dogs today. Uh huh. And uh, don't feed your dog a real donut. I just like donuts. <laughs> yes, don't feed your dog any donuts. That would not be good. Uh, we will see you guys tomorrow for our next video. Bye. Bye.